Hello everyone, Toastbloxy here. So you must ask, why I uploaded the odd video from my usual ones? Well, I'd just like to say my point of view in a situation that's ongoing right now in the Skyward server. So recently, according to some friends of mine, I've been going under fire in the Skyward server after Misha officially left the server. Now, from what I've been shown, the heat going on right now is just a factor of either over-exaggeration or misinformation and slander. So let's start from the beginning. I was with my friend in the voice chat and he was screen sharing his Discord. And then I realized he was in the Skyward server. I then asked him what was his religion, in which he responded with Islam. I then sent a screenshot of Misha disrespecting the religion of Islam to be more specific. Just a daily reminder that I'm a Christian. Continuing, after that, he reposted the screenshot to the Skyward Screenshots channel. First, the message got deleted and then he sent it one more time in which he got banned from the server. Now, in my personal opinion, getting banned from a server over a screenshot that exposes one of your administrators, or former administrators in this case, demonstrates a lot of what you have in terms of freedom of speech in that server. After that, I added some friends of mine into a group chat. And basically, I told one of them to send the screenshot again. Only one time, only one screenshot, and he also got banned. Anyway, one of my friends accidentally revealed that I was the one that asked him to do the following of sending the screenshots. And by the way, these two friends, as said, as stated before, they only sent one screenshot. So it's not considered spamming, it's not considered harassment. We did not do that. We, all we did was send the screenshot into media and ping and ping Brian. Media or screenshots channel. Beanie and Katie then DM'd me and just to remind you, these both are over 18. Katie messaged me saying that I was still obsessed over my band and etc, which honestly is out of context, had nothing to do with the situation, and either way, it's a lie. I don't really care about my Skywars band, I'm a man of truth. If someone sends me evidence of any person doing something bad, I will either confront that person or reveal it to the public when left with no choice. Me and Beanie then had an argument in DMs, which resulted to them blocking me. Anyway, the next day, Misha apparently left the Skywars server and now is at blame. According to some friends of mine, I completely got slandered in general over asking my friends to send a simple screenshot of how Misha acted to a bunch of Muslims. This resulted into both of my friends, Redstone and Breeder, to blocking me. I won't go much into that situation, but Breeder himself doesn't have much knowledge on the situation as shown in the screenshot of this DM from one of my friends. My guess is that he's doing this just to attract with the public. My personal theory though. So. To bring more context regarding the screenshot that you're viewing right now, apparently some Muslim people were bringing their religion as a way of justifying to be homophobic. At least from what I think, religion restricts you from liking people your own gender. But I do not think it says to not support other people's opinions and criticize them for their own likes. Anyway, after they used religion for attempting to justify their poor actions of homophobia, Misha replied with this following message that you can see in the video right now. As we can see, the context is not needed much. Misha still acted in an unprofessional way, whether or not who started it. The homophobic people received punishment for their actions, Misha didn't. To this day, I still think that both respective sides should have taken punishment instead of only one side. To reply to Beanie though, not enough context can save Misha from this situation. He still said the word that is slanderous to an entire religion and deserved punishment for it. They will also show a screenshot of Misha apologizing to Redstones. But Redstones doesn't represent their entire religion. He doesn't represent the entire Islam religion. It should be a public apology, as that offended an entire community, not only Redstones. Now, these people barely provide any evidence to back up their point on basically slandering a 15-year-old in general for just telling friends to show a screenshot of how Misha was being Islamophobic. Instead, they completely over-exaggerate the situation, villainizing me like I harassed Misha or doxed him or something. This is honestly just so stupid that I can't even. Anyway, I won't list all of the misinformation they said regarding me or else you'd be watching this video for like one hour. And well, I'm too lazy to do that. But I think this is enough to demonstrate one thing. Well, actually two things. First of all, do not believe people in the internet unless they provide actual evidence. In this case, these people who love slandering me for asking friends to send a screenshot provided basically no evidence at all and completely over-exaggerated the situation. Just a daily reminder that Beanie's over 18, guys, 
and they'd be doing this. Pretty crazy, I'm not even gonna lie. And the second thing is how this situation just showed me what the definition of fake things are. I think the specific fake friends, though, fake friends in this case know who I'm talking about. Anyway, I'd also like to discuss one more thing that isn't actually on the script, and that is uh, I might change contents uh, on this channel. I won't decide yet, yet. I'll discuss with you guys if I do plan something. But I honestly don't feel comfortable recording videos for a game that basically like almost the entire staff team completely changed. The only person, and I will literally say this in public, that didn't change uh, after fame was Eli. Anyway, have a great day, guys. I know y'all's intention span is getting off the radar. And literally, I had to put those pause with production in my second channel video just because of this situation. Anyway, see you next time. Bye, bye. <laughs>